Wow, that's a lot of tanks. I tell you, we're done for. Do I have to keep Tiger? I know we're done for. We're just fighting, man. You don't have to surrender just because you're losing. It's not fun to be stomped sometimes. Yeah, exactly. I think it's a good lesson to learn. So here, this is actually part of what needs to be practiced, guys, is in hard situations, we gotta have productive mindsets, not defeatism. We gotta think, okay, here's the problem. Let's communicate the problem, try to come up with a solution. Because if we speak in general, you know, emotional defeats, it just drags us all down. This is good emotional endurance training. I mean, I'm just pragmatic here, saying we're done for anyways, so working fighting. I just told you why. Because this is practice. We're not we're not playing to win a million dollars. We're playing to have fun. Well, if you have fun being stunned. Well, that's what I'm saying. That's part of the. You can have fun playing this game even when you're losing. That's what I'm trying to tell you. See what another thing you guys got to realize is the type of comebacks we've had. The games we've posted on YouTube. We've come back from horrible, horrible, looking situations. Guys, this is part of our mantra, right? Of our channel. If you predicate whether or not you're having fun based on if you're winning, then you're already losing. If you give yourself the chance to walk away from a video game upset, then it's like, you gotta question why you're playing video games at all. We play to have fun, dude. I feel like I need to make some more YouTube videos around this concept. So let's, let's be real. This is why a person like me uses demo charges and goliaths because if I could just get that one, that one punch in, that's what I'm gonna remember. Like, like picture if like you're, you're fighting, you're boxing somebody that's like a heavyweight and you're a lightweight. Like, you're not gonna win, but if you could get in a couple good uppercuts, you're gonna remember that. So that's all I'm doing. Just try to get those uppercuts, remember those. Like, you know when you first play a game and you're just like captivated by the graphics and the new style of it and you don't even care, right? Cause you're just like so enthralled. You don't have to lose that. Like, we lose that when we start focusing on the tactics and winning. You can, like, and that's what I learned with this game, because I actually went down that road. I'm, I always actually see myself tempted to go down that road of like, I gotta win, I gotta win, that's what's... And then if, like, there was a season, if I ended on a bad loss, it's like, going to sleep was difficult, because I just was frustrated. Like, losing a close game. But now you gotta view it as like, dude, I would rather have a close game and lose every time just because of that feeling you get, the intensity over some easy comp stomp style game. And the highlights, so like, guys, montages are a classic example of like me choosing to remember the fun moments. I don't know if I won those games that those clips came from. And ultimately, I'm not gonna, like even if I won every single game, I wouldn't even remember the victory. I'm gonna remember like those little moments that happened in the game. That's what I try to focus on. Like if we're, if we're getting our butts kicked, it's like, okay, well then let's throw winning out the window and let's just think about how many tanks can we destroy? Can we, can we kill one of their blobs before the game ends? Like you gotta change the rules in your mind of what's fun.